Before we start today's episode, I'd like to quickly say, remember to check out Surrender 20, this is where I gave all of my information from and all of that good stuff. So, if you guys want to know anything extra that I don't actually talk about in today's video, make sure to head over to surrenderat20.net. Hello everybody and welcome back again, my name is Endersex Steven and welcome to the PBE update 5.14, or what I would like to call it as the pirate update, because this update is basically a massive change the, to the whole, well nearly, the whole of Belgewater. The main bread and butter of this update, well it's the second bread and butter I guess, it's the new game mode! Yay! Uh. So this game mode is basically just like Gangplank's new passive -y thing for his ultimate. You basically buy stuff. So it is called Black Market Bla uh, Brawlers. God, I can't speak. It's placed on Summoner's Rift. It's five v five and it's blind draft. Yay! So basically, instead of gaining the what they like silver, I said I forgot what they called silvers, something now, you get things called krakens. Golden krakens are the new currency that you can spend, and basically how you get them is every sixty seconds you get one. For a kill you get two. For assist you get one. Dragon and baron kill you get one per team member, which is a total of five. For countering jungler, for countering. Counter jungling a large monster, you get one kraken, and destroying an inhibitor won't summon a siege minion, but instead buff all of the brawlers in that lane. So, what are the brawlers? Well, there are many brawlers. Yeah, there's four in total. You have the ironbacks. These are the melee uh, tanky siege minions, and your iron bat takes 25% reduced damage from enemy turrets. That's what you get if you upgrade them once. Your iron bat deal will 175% damage to enemy structures. Gain a shield that blocks the next basic attack from a champion or a turret. Turret, the shield cooldown is 10 seconds. At level 2, your iron bat now deals 250% damage to enemy structures. While the shield is active, it takes 35% reduced damage from minions. Your iron back deals 300 and set there 325 percent damage to enemy structures at level three, and the cooldown of the shield is reduced down to three seconds. Is now and it only now takes 60 percent reduced damage from minions. <sighs> the next one is the razor fin. This is the melee champion pursuer. So when you first by him, your razor fin now, uh, your razor fin has 100% bonus attack speed at level one. Upon aguing a enemy champion, it will pursue them endlessly while attacking the enemy champion. Your razor fin has a 100% increased movement speed and ignores unit collision. At level two, each time your razor fin hits an enemy champion. It applies a mark. On the third mark, Razor Fins deal 300% damage to that target. At level 3, your, you now, your two Razor Fins will spawn for you in each wave. <sighs> Plunder Crabs. This is the raid, this is the ranged arrest champion thing. Initial high, your Plunder Crab shoots an additional shot at a nearby enemy with 150 bonus range. But only at 50% damage. At level one, your plunder crab has a hundred as uh, 50 attack range, gains a stacking two and 20% attack speed buff up to 150% for three seconds every time they hit an enemy champion. At level two, your plunder crab has a hundred attack range, deals 150 damage on hitting an enemy champion, and at level three, your plunder crab has 150 attack range. On hit bonuses now apply when hitting enemy minions and shoots an additional shot at all nearby enemy champions. Jesus. The next one is the Autopods. This is the more specially type of one. This is the ranged support utility. At initial hire, you get your Octopod casts a, a magic shield on allied minions every 10 seconds. Blocking a hundred plus two times octopods AD, the shield lasts ten seconds. 
at level 1. Your Octopod now has 10 magic resist, respawning and moving clovins every 30 seconds after 4 second interval delay. It grants vision to a nearby area for 4 seconds. At level 2, your Octopod now has 20% magic resistance. Shield now blocks 250 plus 2 times Octopod's AD damage and is cast every 4 seconds. Your Octopod at level 3 has 30 magic resist. Clairvoyance is now cast every 10 seconds and the revealed delay is reduced to 2 seconds. Duration and distance travelled of the Clairvoyance is increased by 50%. Holy hell! That's all the monsters. This is flipping ridiculous. I'm not going to keep on saying about all the rest of the stuff so you can do upgrades as I've said. Their cost in total for level 1 is 50 Krakens, 2 is 10 Krakens, and 3 is 20 Krakens. So, it has all of this stuff. I recommend go read it all up. There is so much. Literally. There is so much stuff. Just look at it all. Like, holy hell. If you guys want to go and read it up on this, I recommend going do so because this is so much stuff. I'm not going to cover it all here. So, <sighs> so yeah, that is the 5.14 pirate update. A lot of stuff, to be honest. <sighs> anyway, hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. Sorry for talking so long, and have a wonderful day. Until next time, guys. Bye-bye.